Hi folks, it's Nola. I've been to the thrift store, so I want to quickly show you what I found. I went to a um, church thrift store yesterday. I found these little flowers. They were in, actually in a package of stuff. I took the flowers out and told them I'd pay for the whole package, but I didn't want the other things. So uh, she gave them to me anyway. And um, they're very pretty. I'm thrilled. So I got those. I got this purse clip with a big lobster claw on it for 50 cents. I got this package of um, ladybugs here. I got these two packages of bling. Um, these earrings and then these. I'm not sure whether those are fish or what they are, but they're cute. So I got those there as well. This little doily for a quarter. And oh. I got this um, curtain. And there's the, it's a tree sort of. I got that there. And another one with just flowers on it. Quite a big piece. So that was that thrift store. And then I went to a garage sale. And this was a church garage sale. They were raising money. So I got a whole bag of things. And this is how it starts. This half a uh, thing here with the stitching on the bottom and then we have a sunbonnet Sioux runner with tatting on the bottom um, this one has no stains or anything on it very pretty and I love sunbonnet Sioux then we have this um, runner as well with the pretty sewing on the edge or and this one, I'm going quickly because I don't want to run out of time. Pretty sewing on the edge. Most of them have. Then this one. This one has quite a bit of stains on it, but, you know, I might be able to save it for something. It's a runner, but it's all being uh, cross-stitched. We have these two linen um, doilies and then we have these three with the stitching. Um, these two little cloths. I don't know what these little g tiny guys were for. I would assume this bigger one's for a tray. It's a tray cloth. But I don't know what that one would have been for. Um, here's another one. This is a round tablecloth. And look at this edge on that. Isn't that gorgeous? And that's all stitched as well. And this one's a small round one. This one is all stained, but the edge, look at that sewing. That would be lovely on a sunbonnet Sioux. Then we have another sunbonnet Sioux here. This one doesn't have tatting on it. It has this beautiful edge. But uh, all linen, still really stiff, beautiful. Then we have a little, oh, this is a tea cloth. And they have crocheted the edge around the whole thing. Teeny, 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 tiny little stitches. Beautiful. This is another uh, runner, and it has these patterns all along. It's quite a big, quite a big runner. Then we have this one. 
doily with this gorgeous edge on it. And this one. This linen doily. Two little round linen doilies. I thought this one was painted, but it's not. I thought it was Artex, but it isn't. It's stitched. And this is applique. These leaves are applique. Very pretty. It's a little, little tablecloth. It does have stains on it, though. And then I got these few doilies. Um, these two are the same. And this one. And then this one. I believe this one is homemade. I don't think one, I think one of those is just a bought one. But beautiful. And then this little napkin. And this little tray cover is folded in half. And then this tray cover. So I was a happy, happy girl. Oh, I also got this in that pile. In the bag, there was also this lace collar. So I think all in all, I paid them something like $7 for all of that. Um, and they were happy. I was thrilled. And I found these books. Um, this one is about uh, a girl painted this years ago, painted uh, by memory pictures of all her favorite flowers. And then they've written kind of a story about it in here. But they've got all the um, paintings that she did. And uh, I'll get a darker one. They're gorgeous. Gorgeous paintings. Gorgeous paintings. A nice story. So um, I like the pictures very much, so they might go on something. Then I found, being a quilter, a book on jelly roll quilts. So I think I paid $2, which is much better than the full price would have been. Full price probably was twenty-seven fifty. So I was thrilled with that. And then I got this one, cat quilts. I just thought it was cute. Um, it's all applique, and uh, this book would have normally been, I don't even think it's sold in Canada, because it's got a U.S. price of $23.95, and no Canadian price, so um, it's got some of the cutest pictures in it. So I really like that, and I got one more book on patterns of the past, and these are Bonnet Girls, which is a real favorite of mine. I probably have every Sun Bonnet Sue book that was ever produced. So I have some more pictures to go by. So I'm thrilled, absolutely thrilled. The, wa the weather here today is horrible. It's been raining for a couple of days and the temperature dropped like a stone. It was nice and warm and now it's... It's going down to four tonight so we will have frost here so that'll be the end of the leaves and all the flowers and everything that you don't cover up tonight if it gets hit with frost then we'll be losing everything actually the trees are starting to turn yellow already which is early this year but we had spring really early too I think the ice broke on the lake almost three weeks sooner than it normally does so I suppose we've had a normal summer, it's just I feel cheated because it's only September and we have so much left to do here and the summer is just running out, it's just not enough time. Anyway, I uh, thought I'd show you those few things that I got and uh, see what you think. I don't think I need any more tablecloths or doilies for a while, I'm going to have to share with somebody. So. Uh, That'll be next. 
So thank you all for watching. Thank you to all my subbies. Um, I'm still very close to 400. So when I reach 400, I will put together a package and uh, have a little giveaway. So anyway, thank you all for watching and take care everyone and we'll talk to you soon. Bye now.